What's going on guys? This is JT here and we'll be here on the iOS server on my free to play account. In this video we're going to be getting into the discount store. It is discount store today. I went ahead and clicked the percentage and I got 70% and I was like what dude did I really get that high of a percentage and honestly I'm going to be buying a couple of different items because that's just such a high percentage and the rate of getting event coins now, I pretty much you pretty much guarantee yourself if you play your cards right to get ten at least ten event coins once a week, right? So I look forward to hopefully IGG keeps the treasure mining event coming through. That would really be bad if they took the coins away from that event because it's really helping out free to play players to the ultimate max. But first, let's go ahead and open up a couple of rewards, and also I have some other things in the warehouse. So as of right now, I have nineteen total coins, which is not bad at all. I don't mind spending. I do want to save some coins, obviously, but with getting 70%, that means anything that costs 10 is now three. So I'm not, I mean, I'm, I'm not worried about spending, let's say, nine coins. So what I have to open up in this video today is quite a bit of stuff. I got, let's see here, I got some hero cards to open up, some really nice hero cards to open up. Also got some treasure chest to open up, and I got some prime 10 insignia packs. So let's go ahead and start off with the chest. I am cheering for the blue crystals from these. All right, a little bit of fame. That is what it is. Okay, some more Karamic Rocks. We'll take that, plus more fame. Come on, how about some Blue Crystal? Ooh, an Empower. Don't really need level 5 Empower, though. And some, that's basically 6,000 fame. All right, so hopefully from these chests, we see some Red Crystals. We didn't see any Blue Crystals. How about some, ooh, two Prime Threes, but those are absolutely useless. Actually, the Blue Karamic Rocks are not bad. We'll take the Red Crystals, ship those. And, okay, we'll take that as well. That's 18,000 fame. Two more Prime Threes. That's where I was getting all my Prime Threes from. I was wondering how I got so many Prime Threes on this account. I got 28 Prime Threes, which is absolutely ridiculous. All right, so we also got some more Castle Chests. I'm going to be cheering for Books and Mastery Essences. No doubt about that. Come on. Okay, we'll take 20. That's 36,000 fame. Sacred Light, that's useless. What else do we got? Another 36,000 fame. How about some Books? We'll take the Books and Mastery Essences. Ah, uh, level five, that is junk, unless, yeah, it's not junk for everybody, but honestly junk for my free-to-play, because I already got, I think, some level eights and nines of Zealous Drive. All right, so I'm definitely cheering for books here. How about 200 books? Book Back-to-back -back books, thank you, and two, one more, one more. Oh, that would have been nice if we could have got 200 books out of that. We also got this chest right here, which I am cheering for either igniting stones or enchantment boxes. Don't really care about level nine talent runes, and definitely don't care about scraps and more scraps all right not what we were looking for all right so we also got a level nine prime insignia now i only have like one or two how many level nine i think i got like one or two level nine prime insignias on this account i might have a couple more i'm not exactly sure but not very many on my free to play so i'm going to be cheering for what i want most honestly so either survival empower Revitalize would be okay, but I already got a bunch of level 8 Revitalize, to be honest with you guys, so it's not like top of my priority. I'd really rather have either Survival or Stealth. I mean, Stealth wouldn't be all that bad, or Empower. Empower would probably be the nicest. Come on, give me Empower. Oh, man, come on. You're going to give me the Saints Trash, man. That's basically the same thing as selling the bag. All right, so we got this, which I'm definitely going to be cheering for. Either the Middle Karamic Rocks, uh, the 20 pack of them, or... Um, the superior trait cards. And that's exactly the Karamic Rocks we were cheering for. We'll take another 20 pack of that. Okay, how about another 20 pack? I'll take 60 of those. Okay, I'll definitely take 60 of those Karamic Rocks. That makes it nice and easy for whenever I get into Destiny. We also have this Prime Hero card. Now, the only hero I'm missing from this hero card is Boogeyman. So, obviously, cheering for Boogeyman because I'd have a new hero on the free to play. Come on, Boogeyman me up. Ripa! That's okay. Whatever. We'll get some more of those cards. And we also got an event hero card, which I'm going to open up after these prime insignia tins. I don't think I have anything else to open, right? No. So let's go ahead and snake. Let's go ahead and open up this prime insignia tin. All right. Prime insignia tins. We got to stay away from those favors, man. I would be down to get almost anything in prime insignia tin because I don't have really any prime insignia tins besides the Warden Insignias. Anything besides the Warden Insignias, boys. Come on, man, please. Anything but the Warden Insignias. What do we got coming from the first one? Okay, level 10 Sacred Light. We can't be mad about that. We can't be mad about level 10 Sacred Light. Now, I want to stay away from Sacred Light now, and I definitely don't want Unholy Pact. Actually, I take that back. I don't want Unholy Pact. I want Survival, Revitalize, or Empower, or anything on the bottom row, to be honest. A level 10 Stealth would be freaking epic. Come on. No! Stay away from that junk, man. All right, let's do another one. 
Don't be another... Fi okay. We'll take a level 10 stealth, man. I'm not mad about that, actually. A level 10 stealth. Okay, I'm happy with that. We got stealth. We also got... Man, we got some good stuff there. Stealth and also uh, Sacred Light. We'll take that. Two level 10 insignias on the free-to-play. You can't be mad about that. All right, so obviously from the Hero Event card, we've gotten Hot Shot in the past. We've gotten Rambard in the past. I would love to see any of the other three heroes, preferably a Fox or a Sanctus. Or a Bloody Mary would be okay as well. But stay away from Hot Shot. Stay away from the Rambard. Come on, baby. What do we got? A Rambard. All right, well, now we got a backup Rambard on the free-to-play. Not what we were looking for. However, let's go ahead and get into that discount score. I'll show you guys what we got popping. So I got 70%. And look at that, boys. So I got this Prime Hero card right here. If I want to get it, there is one, two, three, four heroes that I don't have on my free-to-play on this card. So I don't really think I can shy away from getting that card, to be honest with you guys. And I got to get the fame as well, I think. Uh, just because it's 800,000 fame, it's 70%. I could use the 800,000 fame for Karamek Rocks. Another thing, I could boost up all kinds of different heroes destiny with that. So I'm definitely going to snatch that up. The hero card, I mean, it only costs three coins. Got to snatch that up. This is the one that I'm debating. It's like, do I want to get this? Because I've opened up quite a few of these. The odds of getting Rune Master and, uh, is it Ice Fox or Ice Lady? Whatever the, the cold girl hero down there is at the bottom. The odds of getting either one of those heroes is only 3%, right? So 3% obviously isn't that good. However, I need the Queen Wasp really bad on this account in order to boost up my Dove Keeper to higher destiny. So I think I'm going to go ahead and buy it, to be honest. I think I'm going to buy it, boys. I think I'm going to buy it. Let's go ahead and buy it and let's go ahead and open it up. Come on, man. Y'all wish me luck. So now we still got 10 event coins, which is more than enough. I'm happy with 10 event coins. And we got 800,000 fame. That is just so sexy, boys. All right, so let's go ahead and get in. What do we got coming? We'll go ahead and open up this hero card first. Now, obviously, the main thing I'm cheering for is... What's this, what's this hero's name? Is it Ice Lady? I'm just tripping myself out. Is it Ice Lady? Ice Lady, all right. So I'm either cheering for Ice Lady, mainly Rune Master, for sure. I mean, Rune Master is definitely who I'm cheering for the most. But I wouldn't be mad with Ice Lady either. And I don't have Landwalker or Queen Wasp. The, probably the best role besides Rune Master for me is going to be Queen Wasp. Just stay away from everything I don't, everything I already have. Come on, baby. Queen Wasp me up. What do we got? Crystal Wraith, are you kidding me? That's terrible, man. All right, so we got another hero card official event, boys. What do we got coming? Come on, baby. Give me a fox. Give me a fox. It's going to give, no, nah, I ain't even going to say his name. It's going to give me a fox. I'm feeling a fox. How about a Bloody Mary or a fox? Bloody Mary fox. Bloody Mary fox. Come on. Man, come on, man. I was going to say, it's going to give me a hot shot, man. That's absolutely ridiculous. Do we have anything else to open up? I don't really think we do. I think all this is just a bunch of trash that I'm saving for no real reason, honestly. Open up the 200 crystals, which I don't really even need right now. Oh, that's brutal, boys. All right, we got a lot of fame, though. At least we're happy about that. And we got a lot of gems, too. We got 20,000 gems, basically 21,000 with the extra bonus. We got a lot of books. I got a lot of igniting stones. I mean, how many igniting stones do I got? The reason why I'm saving my... Oh, man. this These Destiny Karmic Rocks, that was a huge opening with those, too. I'm happy about that. So, with the igniting stones, I got 27,000, basically, igniting stones, which is pretty solid, all in all, to be honest with you guys. Happy with 27,000 of those, because I am planning on... I'm actually going to wait. I'm probably going to get my Rambard up to like uh, 20, probably right around 20. I'm thinking probably stop right at 20 with Rambard just because I want Rambard to be beefed up just a little bit. But I do want to save most of my Igniting and Zenith Stones because I feel like I'm going to get Levanica or Zephyrica sooner than later. And so I've been leveling up all these heroes with Enlightened to level 200 first. And the reason why is obviously because gives me the extra books books are just so hard to come by so it's like all right you know what i might as well do that so that's what i'm working on leveling that stuff up and also let me see where is my rambard at i'm gonna go ahead and roll a quick uh i'm gonna go ahead and roll a quick couple talents on them just because we need that true piety come on man maybe i should make a video of rolling 100 of these uh chests flame guard that's not bad but not what we're looking for we got berserk come on true piety all right we'll roll two more 
Deadly Strike, and come on, hook it up with the troop. Ooh, Enlighten. All right, we're happy with the Enlighten. I'll find somewhere to put that. Anyway, guys, hope y'all enjoyed the video. Really wish we could have got some better stuff out of, or at least like a Bloody Mary or something from those event cards. But, you know, I mean, not mad about it. We got those level 10 insignias. Let me go ahead and take a quick rundown of my insignias for in this video. So, I mean, my insignias, big help, dude, big help. And we got a couple level 8 empowers. We got that level 10 sacred light, which is just so sexy. That stealth is nice, man. That stealth is nice. It stinks we got two favors, which is really horrible. But that level 10 stealth, that's going to be nice. That's going to fit really well somewhere. I don't even know where I'm going to put that, but it's going to be nice somewhere. Anyway, guys, hope you all enjoyed the video. I am out of here for now. Peace out.